Cooking is a challenge. For those evenings when working the oven seems more difficult than climbing Mount Everest, here are the top 10 best frozen dinners ranked from worst to best. Feast your eyes. Dinner is served. Hungry Man Roasted Carved White Meat Turkey. Food. Ah! Who said that? Hungry Man Roasted Carved White Meat Turkey is packed with white meat turkey, creamy mashed potatoes, gravy, seasoned stuffing, and mixed vegetables. That's basically all the food groups, isn't it? But out here in the U.S. of age, buddy, we got something called the four basic food groups. It's been a staple for decades now, ever since the invention of the microwave. It's one of life's small pleasures to be able to come home after a long, hard day at the office or a short, easy day at the beach and not worry about cooking. Hungry Man is as delicious and filling as it is easy to prepare. Not only is this dinner packed with foods universally loved, but it has the added bonus of festive nostalgia. Who doesn't want to experience Thanksgiving dinner seven nights a week for a lifetime? All of us, probably. But think of it this way. It's all the joy and deliciousness of Thanksgiving or Christmas without having to endure hours of forced conversation with distant relatives. It even comes with an apple cranberry dessert. And if ever roasted carved white meat turkey gets repetitive, Hungry Man has oodles of different dinner options for you to try. Can't you see I've got my hand full? Stouffer's lasagna with meat and sauce. Once again, my life has been saved by the miracle of lasagna. Stouffer's lasagna with meat and sauce includes traditional lasagna noodles layered with an herb-seasoned tomato and meat sauce and three kinds of natural cheese. Lasagna is one of those dishes that satisfies the hunger demons living deep within all of us. The ones that beckon from the depths, screaming out to be satisfied by not one, not two, but three kinds of natural cheese. They have got it down to a science. Although the name lasagna with meat and sauce may not be the most romantic description of a dish ever written, and sort of feels like it was created by a robot built in the 80s, the dish itself is rich creamy, and delicious. Not only does it contain 100% pure beef, but just thinking about three kinds of natural cheese makes the mouth water and the hips sway to imaginary Italian music. Stouffer's lasagna with meat and sauce also comes in a party size portion. So call over six friends and turn the next meal into a giant lasagna party. Now. Enjoy the lasagna. I added the special seasoning myself. Stouffer's Mac and Cheese. Macaroni and cheese? Hey, you know what I like. Stouffer's Mac and Cheese is freshly made pasta in real cheddar cheese sauce. So cheesy. It doesn't beat around the bush, it doesn't care to boast or impress or distract with fancy ingredients and highfalutin hoity-toity descriptions. It's mac and cheese, and it's a trip to Yumtown. Stouffer's mac and cheese is the dish everyone falls in love with as a kid. This food is so good. It's a classic dish, and it is literally good for any occasion. It's great on a Tuesday evening spent alone watching reruns of The Simpsons. It's great as a side dish at a family barbecue. It's great for traveling. It's even great for breakfast. Stouffer's mac and cheese also comes in a family size, but that's really just a suggestion. What? Max famous mac and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Lean Cuisine Vermont White Cheddar Mac and Cheese. It's the producers over at Mac and Cheese, if you'll excuse me for a minute. Lean Cuisine Vermont White Cheddar Mac and Cheese is filled with cavatappi pasta and a rich Vermont White Cheddar Cheese sauce. Creamy, cheesy deliciousness. If ever regular cheddar cheese gets a little same old, same old, then spice it up, or spice it down, and try white cheddar cheese. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'd give it as... So be free from traditional mac and cheese dinners, free from the orange cheese that has become the norm, and try this tasty dish from Lean Cuisine. The box boasts now with more cheese, which begs the question, what took so long to get more cheese in this thing? Shouldn't there always have been more cheese? 
And if every box says that every time, does that mean that every single box of Lean Cuisine Vermont White Cheddar Mac and Cheese has more cheese than the box that preceded it? If a tree falls in the forest and no one is around to hear it, does it make a sound? Oh. <clears throat> Maybe just eat the cheese. The Lean Cuisine Vermont White Cheddar Mac and Cheese. I know what a TV dinner feels like. Pogo. Santa brought him that pogo stick. For the uninitiated, a pogo is a hot dog on a stick that's covered in a delicious batter. They come in packs ranging from 4 to 120 and can be eaten by the dozen with ease. Sure, some might squirt a little mustard or ketchup on them every once in a while, but pogos are satisfying all by themselves. How's that? Yum. They're the minimalists in the world of frozen dinners. Have one for a snack or have 13 for a big dinner when hunger really peaks. They're great while watching the game, a movie, or studying for a math quiz. The legend behind Pogo is that they were invented by an English pub owner named Leopold Kerr in 1962 to lure his patrons into drinking more. Thank goodness for Leopold Kerr for providing the world with a doughy hot dog. Of all the foods that come on sticks, this food is at the top of the heap. And that's saying something. Get that cone out of my face! Amy's Cheese Enchilada. Hey, hey, you ate my enchilada! Amy's Cheese Enchilada consists of two corn tortillas filled with olives, peppers, a blend of cheese, and covered in enchilada sauce. These things are gooey. Gooey in the best possible way. These are for when you're not concerned about making a mess, spilling cheese everywhere, and dirtying tablecloths. When the sole concern is all about satisfaction, Amy's Cheese Enchilada delivers. It really could go for some enchiladas. These enchiladas are not eaten, they are devoured. There is no other way when it comes to enchiladas. They are for the ravenous, the famished, the ones who care not for potential heartburn I get it, you pesto bismol. or observing manners while eating. They are for those who love Mexican food but need it in under two minutes. Wow. The lust for frozen Mexican food is real, and the cure is Amy's Cheese Enchilada. Red Baron Classic Crust Pepperoni Pizza. My dad is so lame, so is he, but with this crust, I can live with them. Red Baron Classic Crust Pepperoni Pizza is high up on the list for good reason. It's a delicious take on probably the greatest food ever invented. It's cheesy, the sauce tastes like it was made in the finest Italian kitchen, and the pepperoni is made with pork, chicken, and beef. The Red Baron himself is displayed proudly on the box with his red scarf flapping in the breeze. He flies all over the world and single-handedly delivers the pizzas to grocery stores. Take one look at the Baron's chin and know that he will not rest until his pizzas are tasted by the masses. Look into those deep blue eyes. He could have had it all. He's handsome, strong, and a licensed pilot. But no, he gave it all up, the fortune and the fame, because his passion lay elsewhere. It lay in frozen pizzas. All he asked in return is that his image be prominently displayed on each and every box. Some might say that's egotistical. Don't judge. When you make a frozen pizza as delicious as this, if you want your face right there on the box, you got it. He started it. He ate my pizza on purpose. Marie Callender's 14-ounce Salisbury Steak. This dish delivers the classic taste of Salisbury steak and comes with traditional brown gravy, oven-roasted potatoes, and vegetables in a creamy cheese sauce. You got special sauce! 14 ounces of beef is enough to satisfy even the most hard-working lumberjack. When a delicious home-cooked meal is what's desired without the actual cooking, dig into this traditional comfort food. Marie Callender's has been whipping up tasty dishes for ages now, and this meal is considered a classic for a reason. It holds up with age and stands the test of time. 
It's meat, potatoes, and vegetables in a creamy cheese sauce. Put it down with a glass of milk or just gobble it up without anything to quench the thirst. Heck, drink the gravy! This meal really does taste homemade, so if ever there's a need to cook for guests but not enough time to do it, just pop four of these little delights into the microwave, put them on plates, discard the evidence, pretend everything is normal, and the dinner guests will have no idea until it's way too late. California Pizza Kitchen's Slow-Cooked Pulled Pork Pizza Pizza dude's got 30 seconds. California Pizza Kitchen makes unbelievably delicious pizza in many different varieties, and few are more scrumptious than the slow-cooked pulled pork pizza. It's tender pulled pork, poblano peppers, mozzarella, and feta cheeses, and a spicy black bean sauce on a crispy, thin crust. It also says that it's a limited edition, so there are probably only about seven left on the entire planet. These things are worth more than gold at this point. Finding one is probably like finding the golden ticket in the Charlie and the Chocolate Factory movie. Pizzas were meant to be enjoyed, and maybe one day California Pizza Kitchen will wise up and make this style of pizza an unlimited edition. But until that time, chow down on this tasty pulled pork pizza while you can. It's from California, where the sun is warm, the beach is sandy, and the ocean wet. The sunshine can practically be tasted when biting into these pies. Just enjoy the tasty pizza by these good-hearted folks from the Sunshine State. No, wait, that's Florida. Florida has absolutely nothing to do with these pizzas. California is apparently the land of milk and honey. So, yeah, not a great reference when talking about pizza. But don't let that stop you from giving the slow-cooked pulled pork pizza a try. Never pay full price for late pizza. I gotta get a new route. Swanson's Fried Chicken Dinner. Swanson's a little piece of perfection in a box. Fried chicken is tasty as the day is long, and Swanson's definitely knows this fact. They produce a mouth-watering fried chicken recipe that includes a plump, boneless chicken breast with mashed potatoes, corn, and, wait for it, a rich chocolate brownie. They didn't have to do that. The chicken, taters, and corn was plenty, but they did it anyways because Swanson's cares about satisfying their customers. So grab some hot sauce, some ketchup, some mayo, no judgment, slather it all over that chicken and dig in. It's gonna be a crispy, juicy taste experience that rivals any fried chicken restaurant that serves chicken in big paper buckets. Swanson's even boasts that this dish is the best-selling single-serve frozen meal in Canada. Hey, 37 million Canadians couldn't be wrong, eh? Oh, Canada! Just as the last morsel of crispy chicken has been eaten, the last dollop of mashed potatoes scooped up, and the last corn kernel dropped on the floor, behold, the brownie. Almost forgot about it, didn't you? It's still there, waiting to be eaten. A rich, chocolatey, moist brownie that could clean up at any local elementary school bake sale. Those brownies are magnificent. The brownies were the deciding factor in giving Swanson's Fried Chicken Dinner the top prize for best frozen dinners. Take a bite out of one of our other great videos and hit that subscribe button and ring that bell to join our notification squad.